Hey, it's just a reading here. Today is March 25th, 2023. And the time is 1.53 a.m. I'm going to be doing a Pisces reading. No projection, clean energy only. A true understanding, a clear understanding. This may be for you and this may not be for you. So take it as it goes, all right? Got some incense going. <clears throat> for Pisces. March 25th, 2023. I already pre shuffled the cards, but I always do it again for y'all. Do this three times. Get into your guys' energy. Pisces. This flew out. The Knight of Swords. You may be impatient right now. You got some assertiveness. Action, action, action. All right. Right here with the Five of Pentacles. <clears throat> some hardship. You may be sick right now underneath the weather. The weather is changing up with this spring. You got the page of wands. Confident, though. You got a new journey ahead of you. Very fearless. Whether you're sick or not, you're moving fast. Confident energy right here with the empress. And this is you right here. You may be a mother. Very abundant, though. Heart, mind, body, and soul. You go the seven of wands. I keep, I keep seeing the seven of wands in y'all readings and I'm not liking it. Could be some sneaky ass energy around or coming back around. Mm -mm. A thief, a scammer may be around you or may be coming around you. This flew out, but you already got away from this person with the queen of wands energy and the six of swords. Very independent. Don't give a fuck. So... That's good. Right here at the bottom with the three of swords. Some heartbreak, grief, trauma, depression. Tell me more about this knight of swords. You know me, I hop right into it. Only my angels and ancestors are welcome to the reading. Right here with death. Something's coming to an end or a new beginning is here. That's why it's rushing in. It may be ending fast or something may be coming in good fast. These two cards flew out, and we're going to go ahead and get into it. Maybe a new love right here with this two of wands energy. They may be traveling towards you or planning for the future. You have a decision to make, though. But something is uh, here with this new beginning, like I said, or it was the ending. Maybe maybe ending with this lover that you're dealing with, and you have a decision making. Or this could be a new lover coming around, and you have a decision to make. The romance is definitely here. Tell me more about this Five of Pentacles. With this romance, is this this person following behind you that needs something from you? Because you are the king of pentacles. You are wealthy. Tell me more. Is this king of pentacles. Uh-oh. You got the four pentacles in reverse and the knight of wands. Wait, all these fell out, so we're not taking all of these, okay? Like I said, only take two when they fall out. If it's more than two, no. So disregard that. I'm going to shuffle these one more time. Some of these cards, they just be flying out. Well, this one flew out right here with strength. Tell me more about strength. Can we dealing with a Leo? Well, this could be you with Leo in your chart. So you are very brave. And two came out and they were in reverse with this page of pentacles and justice. So somebody might have been dishonest right here with this five of pentacles. You may have lost a job. Hmm. The strength is here with the king of pentacles. So this is a little confusing right here. So this five of pentacles, this earth energy, Virgo, uh, Taurus, and Capricorn energy. Um, strength is here 
the king of pentacles so money may be low for you right now uh pisces something may be in the legal world right here you may be trying to get into the legal um career uh police officer judge justice system you know uh something dealing with the legal world is gonna come you know um but the page of pentacles is saying that you know you can't be lazy you need to have some type of um persistence about you no procrastination right here because this page of pentacles should not be in reverse okay if you're the king of pentacles so something's coming to an end with a job or you got some legal issues or trying to get into the legal world you need to not be lazy and you need to go for what you need to go for you need to be persistent like i said don't sit and wait for something to come to your door with this five of pentacles okay because you need to work hard so no slack. A lot of y'all might be just sitting a little bit, trying to figure out what's the next move. Not all of y'all. It's not going to apply to all of y'all, okay? And I'm not a financial advisor, so don't be coming for me. But I'm just saying, for some of y'all, if y'all just chilling right now, y'all need to pick that back up. You know, get back to working to this King of Pentacles energy, all right? This is not for all of y'all, though. Tell me more about this page of wands, please. Because this is somebody who's confident. You're very confident. So I know you can make it. Tell me more about this page of ten, uh, page of wands. If I said the page of pentacles, I'm sorry because I'm still looking at this page of pentacles in reverse. Tell me about this page of wands for Pisces. Page of wands, and these came out. So this one is upward. This one is in reverse. So ten of swords, somebody probably portrayed you as a breakdown, something hit rock bottom. This is probably why you are having a little little stagnant issue right here with this page of pentacles, but it's gonna be okay. Cause the um something's finna come in fast. You're very confident. So that's got something to do with the job right here. Um, the nine of pentacles. Y'all could be very, you know, low on funds, low on money. Uh somebody might have stole from you right here with this seven of swords, and I'm gonna confirm that. But the recent readings I've been seeing, like, something's been going on with y'all money. It might have been somebody that maybe got into y'all bank account. Or, you know, it might be some scammers on the loose. And a lot of motherfuckers are trying to get people's income tax money. A lot of y'all probably didn't get it yet. So if that's going on, it you know, it's going to change, trust me, because you are the empress. Tell me more about this Nine of Pentacles, please. My funds may be low right now. You might put yourself into a bad investment, too, or something or someone that's stealing from you. Here are the Ace of Swords. It's going to be a big breakthrough. It's going to be some truth behind whatever the fuck is going on with your money, okay? Somebody might have did some witchcraft on your money, um, you know, some um, some fucked up as um, black magic. But, honey, trust and believe me, it's, it's not going to last for long because the Ace of Swords here. I feel like there's like some really uh fucked up energy that's trying to fuck with your money. I really feel like somebody is really trying to come for your pockets, may have already stole from you, but trust and believe me, you're finna get the truth about this fucked up person. You are the Empress. So you do have that strong intuition. At the end of the day, you're gonna always have abundance. Tell me about this Empress, please. If my allergies start to mess up, I'm sorry. Y'all already know how it go, okay? I just got really bad allergies, okay? So here's the seven of wands. You're standing up for yourself right here, right? So whoever the fuck this was, this could have been a business partner that you got into. This could have just very well been somebody that was family. Or it could have been somebody that you was with with this ten of cups. But you're standing up for yourself. You're ready for battle. Tell me about the seven of wands. You're standing up. You don't give a fuck. Yeah, let me see what these ones. These are too many that fell out, so we're not going to take them. Tell me more about this seven of wands, please. Right here with the knight of pentacles in reverse. So, you know, this person uh, probably was a fucking deadbeat. Um, they probably were scared that you were making more money than them or you were making the most money. Now they're overthinking. Tell me about this uh, Knight of Pentacles. Somebody was trying to fuck with your money. I feel that. <clears throat> well, they want some money. They trying to get any little thing to some wants. But it's going to be some victory and success celebration here. They're not going to get shit. Tell me more about this Seven of Swords right here. This sneaky ass person. The moon, yep. 
they have illusions. They have very deception, very dark moon energy, shadow side energy. Tell me about this moon, please. With the world right here, delay success. They're finna get delay success right here. Shit's finna be stagnant for them since they're taken from you. Tell me more about this world card in reverse for this person. This is somebody else that's here. This is not you. Somebody else. Right here with the Knight of Swords, yeah. There's going to be some authority coming in. Somebody might, you know, um, come and get them for this. They might have, like I said, this person might be very well a scammer that's trying to take from you or already took from your bank account or something like that. They're trying to, be, I feel like this person is really trying to bring you down, Pisces. This person is a person that's like fucking pissed off, mad or whatever they are. So they they may be, like I said, they may be doing some type of spell work here uh, to your money. <laughs> With this moon right here, with these illusions, like I said, I feel like it's some type of spell work. Then here comes the damn moon card with these illusions and, and uh, deception. So be careful with this King of Swords. I mean, with this um, this Seven of Swords, because the King of Swords here is with that authority. That's you. You finna put a stop to some shit with the Queen of Wands. Is it a Queen of Wands person, or is this you? Tell you more about this Queen of Wands, male or female. Who the fuck is this? The Knight of Cups, the King of Cups, and the Queen of Cups. This could have been somebody that you shared a home with and that you was uh, with. Because the Queen of Cups and the King of Cups are here. Loving, caring people, affectionate, friendly, loving people. So what happened with this? Tell me more. What happened? The Eight of Swords right here, yep. Then I said this could have been somebody that you was with. Look, y'all was both loving each other. You could have been dealing with another water sign, um, Pisces, another Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. They got you in this eight of swords. You might be giving to this person, maybe giving money to this person. And, you know, they're just taking too much from you. Probably still. Well, this is a cup. This could be somebody from the past that could be coming back that needs uh, some type of offer from you. But you probably already moved away from this person. Tell me about the six of swords. What's up with this moving away? The Pisces already move away from this person are going to move away. Tell me more. The three of pentacles, yeah, you're learning. Cause there was t there, there used to be some type of teamwork here. Tell me more about this three of pentacles. It's just a cuss, somebody from the past. There you go. Somebody finna come back, Pisces, and ask you for some money. And they might steal from you. Or they probably already stealing from you. Somebody from the past already stealing from you. It's just a cuss, tell me more. This person don't want shit, but what they want. And it was love here, but it turned into something bad. Right here with the four of pentacles, they probably lost their fucking job. Greedy. This person's a greedy person. Like I said, they might be coming in with this type of offer saying, hey, you know, what's up? And they want something from me. They want some of these pentacles that you got. This could be an earth sign of Virgo, Capricorn, Taurus. Very possessive, controlling that as energy right here with the four of pentacles. They hold on to their money and yours at the bottom. No, ma'am. What's up with this three of uh, swords? Are they coming in? Right here, this is heartbreak, trauma. You may still be going through it with this person. Tell me more about this three of swords. What's going to happen? This is your last card. Right here with the hangman. You might sacrifice yourself or already sacrificing yourself for this person. That's where I don't know why that felt like that. That's weird. Tell me more about this hangman. Something fell underneath my foot. I don't like that. Heavenly Father, protect me during these readings like I always ask you to do. Yeah, I feel this person's negative ass energy. That's probably why my candle underneath my foot fell. Queen of Swords, but you finna protect yourself. Tell me more about this Queen of Swords, please. The 
Queen of Pentacles, yeah. The Ace of Wands. A new beginning for you. You probably already moved on from this person. You self-sacrificed your person for this, but you released this shit. Right here with the Queen of Swords, honest, you're very protected. So you don't have to worry about this person is doing magic on your money. You're protected right here with the Queen of Swords. You're Queen of Pentacles. At the end of the day, you're grounded, you're generous. You're very business oriented. So money is here for you. Fuck this heartbreak. You finna level up. Now I'm gonna go ahead and confirm some of these that came in reverse, because some of them did, if I'm not mistaken. I'll be very careful of this person from the past with this person here already. Because for some of y'all, this is somebody that's here already. This person is not it. This is very well somebody from the past. This is not for everybody to take what resonates. Like I said, if it's the same reading, it's because you're in the same energy. And I read it how it is. Yeah, that's not it. This person going to suck you dry. Yep, there was a lot of these in reverse. It's getting the ones that are, so we can go ahead and clarify them. Put those to the side. So, um, was this Nine of Pentacles in reverse? Yeah, it was in reverse. Yeah, I remember this being in reverse. We gotta clarify all these with just two cards. So tell me more about this Nine of Pentacles. This person who's overthinking. Who's a deadbeat. This is not you. Who the hell is this deadbeat? The Nine of Cups. Yeah, they're finna come in with this sensitive ass romantic proposal to you. But it's the tower right here, honey. It's already ended. So tell me more about this Nine of Cups. Right here, yep, karma. This is a, a turning point. Bye-bye. Tell me more about this Nine of Pentacles in reverse. It's old news. The hermit. Uh-huh. This person may have uh, low funds and they're in hermit mode. Or this could just very well be you. But tell me who this hermit is. Virgo energy, three of cups. This could be a friend. This don't even got to be a lover. But I feel like this is a lover. There was a celebration here with you and this person. With this nine of pentacles. This was a joy, miss, joy, joy, friendship, you know. But now this person is trying to search for the truth. This could be you searching for the truth with this celebration that used to be. With this nine of pentacles. So tell me about justice. Because somebody was dishonest here. Who is this dishonest ass person? So I feel like this is you in hermit mode. Maybe reflected on what it used to be. And you just want to be left alone. And you want the truth. You still want the truth about this person. You probably want to know what the fuck were you here for. With the ten of wands, it was too much going on. Right here. It is a lot of burdens with this person. Right here with this knight of wands. It could have been some very young person with this charming, loving. But they were just too much. They had too much going on. Tell you more about this uh, ten of wands. And they had you right here trying to avoid it right here. Stuck in the middle with this two of swords. Probably still is stuck in the middle with this two of swords energy. I feel like a lot of you guys are. You guys probably want to take this person back. You blind to the truth. But honey, truth is here. So this is you. Tell me who this page of Pentacles is. It's like you don't want to see the truth. But it's here with the Hierophant. This was a Two of Cups. This was a Harmony. This was a soulmate that she was with. Tell me about this Two of Cups. Well, what happened with this soulmate? Because something had to go downhill. With the Eight of Cups, you walked away from this shit. Or they may have abandoned you, ghosted you. Probably was like, uh, whatever. It had you on standby. You wasn't having it, so you got the fuck up the road. So, yeah, this was a soulmate. This was a union. This was a lover. Could have very well been a friend that you had a union with, but this looks like more of a lover. 
with this page of pentacles. This person may have lost their job, but I feel like this is just probably just you who had a financial loss with this person because it was the two of cups and you walked away with this, walked away with all this. This person could have very well been lazy, had no type of, you know, strive, no drive about themselves, was probably leeching off of you. Like I said, with all these pentacles here, it had a lot to do with your money. Tell me more about the world card right here in reverse, because this means a delay, honey. Something is not moving. Why wasn't it moving? The Ace of Pentacles. Yeah. The stability. Tell me more about the uh, the Ace of Pentacles, please. With the Emperor here. And the Four of Cups at the bottom. So yeah, you were the Ace of Pentacles. You are the Emperor. Male or female, you have that control, that control, that structure. You have that money, that business, you know, and it probably got slowed down right here with the world card because you was giving this four of cups to somebody who didn't even fucking want it, who didn't want to um sit here and uh, give what they were supposed to get back, give the same energy back that you were giving. So yeah, this is just a waste of time, Pisces. Um, this person is not it. They got too much. They got too much that they want you to do for them, but they're not doing anything for you. They're like, oh, I need money. I need help. I need this. Blah, blah, blah. Whoop -de -whoop. But what about you? Oh, no, but they don't care about that. Hold on, honey. They don't care about that, honey. What the hell is this on my TV? Child, I'm getting freaked out. I don't know what the hell this is on my TV. It was a bunch of presidents and stuff. I'm like, the hell? I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, that was random. So that I turned my TV on really quick. So I'm about to get ready and watch the news like an old lady. And I'm not even old. <laughs> All right, tell me more. Give me an angel card, please, for Pisces. What do they need to know or keep in mind? What are you doing, sir? That's my dog making that noise. What's up with you? Huh? What's up, dude? <laughs> He's such a baby in his little bed looking at me. All right, for Pisces, what do you need to know? The angel card. I feel like a lot of y'all feel like you still need to help this person, and I wouldn't. So you need to help them damn selves, okay? You did enough. No need to worry, all right? So you're going to be fine. And right here, remain positive, all right? So whatever the fuck is going on, like I said, somebody's trying to tap into your money, fucking with your money. No need to worry. Remain positive. Um, Things are finna change in the near future right here at the bottom. But um, this person with all these burdens and negativity... You don't need to worry about it. Please stay positive. Worry about yourself. Get your money back together. In order to do that, you need to get away from this toxic ass energy that's trying to take your money. Whoever this person is. And like I said, for a lot of you, they're not even probably dealing with this person. But they're about to get ready and come back. So like I said, don't worry and just keep your head up. I wouldn't give in to this person. You already know what they're about. You ain't stupid. Your intuition is very strong. The two of wands, you know, was here. The death is here. Things are finna be rushing in for you. You gotta stay very um on point with that four of wands. So you'll be fine. Just put your foot down. Don't let no but well, the seven of wands, my bad. Stand up for yourself. Don't let nobody run all over you. Don't let people take your uh kindness for weakness. The Pisces people, water signs, period, are very sweet, loving people. They take advantage of y'all. Don't take, don't uh keep giving your four of cups to this person. You're the high priestess. 
you have enthusiasm. And this new beginning is here. Temperance, just balance it out. You are the seven of pentacles. That money going to come in. You don't need this five of wands. Until next time, Pisces. Bye. Mm-hmm. <laughs>